I am the nurse manager for the transitional care unit here at Cardinal Glennon. I've been a nurse here at Cardinal Glennon for over 20 years. Our hospital was really focusing on looking at peripheral IVs and um, reducing harm. Melissa and I were approached um, with this new product and um, we kind of went for it. There is a great culture here at Cardinal Glennon to prevent harm for our patients. Um, we like to think of them as if it was our own kid. Our previous arm boards that we had um, weren't very um, dynamic for the patient's joint um, and required tape. We noticed an increase that those patients that were receiving harm, that the tape was a barrier, that there was a lot of that harm that was going unnoticed because it was either under the tape or the patient or the nurse did not feel comfortable removing the tape to do a thorough assessment of the site. We kind of put together an as far um, as far as what we our situation that we were having, kind of our background, our recommendation of wanting to try this new product, we approached our new products committee um, and they gave us the approval to go ahead and roll out with a trial. We rolled out a trial in November of 2022. We chose three different units. We chose our emergency department, our pediatric ICU, and then our transitional care unit, uh, the TCU. We chose those departments because they see a variety of ages and disease um, processes. For 2022, up until the trial, we had 11 patients that um, were harmed because of their IV. Um, during the trial in November of 22, no patients were harmed because of their IVs. Cardinal Glennon, after our trial was successful, decided to roll out the TLC splint um, mid-January of 2023. Ivy House has been tremendous in helping us roll out the TLC splint. They were able to come here, help us go unit by unit and educate all the nurses that were there. They came in multiple days, they came in multiple shifts to catch all those day and night nurses um, to make sure that you know, our nurses felt comfortable with this new product. We've definitely seen improvement in our um, IV infiltrations and extravasation rate. Since we brought in the TLC splint, we have had zero patients that have been harmed for their IV. It's easier for the nurses to do their assessment. Being able to easily visualize the site, touch the site, those straps are super comfy. The patients don't complain of them. It's comfortable for them to wear. They're not trying to take them off and they really have helped in our success to make sure that no kiddos are getting harmed under our watch. Our nurses love it. They love the sizes. They love, um, we have them all organized in a cart. It fits the specific joints instead of, you know, having an arm board that you're trying to mold into something. Um, these TLC splints fit whether they go on a foot or an elbow or a wrist. And those are very common areas for, you know, our pediatric population. The TLC product has been amazing um, for our committee. It's brought excitement. It's brought new energy to our committee and to our nurses, kind of just drives like the focus of safety and quality here at Cardinal Glennon.